little kitty. Yes, Doctor. Eating sugar. Oh, Doctor. Telling lies. Oh, Doctor. Open your mouth. <laughs> oh, no. I've explained this to you before. But as a gentle reminder, let me answer a helpful question. What if you stopped eating sugar? Zoom in! Sugar is everywhere, from cookies and soda, to foods like bread and pasta sauce. While your body does need some sugar for energy, cutting back or kicking it out completely could lead to some pretty big changes in how you feel. Curious? Let's see how. Well, the first thing you'll notice when you cut sugar is intense cravings. Yes, that's because sugar triggers dopamine, a chemical in your brain that makes you feel good. So, when you stop eating sugar, your brain might throw a little tantrum. Expect to feel cranky or tired for a few days as your brain adjusts to this new sugar-free reality. But don't worry. After about a week, your brain will start to chill out and those cravings will fade. Even better is that you'll notice your energy levels start to stabilize. And how does that work? Well, sugar gives you quick bursts of energy, but that's followed by a crash that leaves you tired and hungry again. Without those sugar bombs, your energy will come more steadily from healthier foods like fruits, veggies and whole grains. These foods fuel your body without sending you on a wild energy roller coaster. As a bonus, you might find that things like apples and berries suddenly taste way sweeter. That's because your taste buds are no longer overwhelmed by all the added sugar you were eating. Mm. Oh, you, a banana could be so delicious on its own. Cutting back on sugar also helps balance a hormone called leptin which is like your body's natural food alarm. It tells your brain when you're full and it's time to stop eating. But when you eat too much sugar, leptin gets all confused and stops working properly, making you overeat. So, reducing sugar can reset that system, helping you feel full and satisfied without overindulging. Now, let's talk about the long-term perks of ditching sugar. First off, cutting sugar helps your liver. Normally, excess sugar gets stored as fat in your liver, which over time can lead to fatty liver disease. But when you cut back, your liver can start to heal, reducing the risk of major issues down the road. And your heart, it will Thank you too! Too much sugar causes fat to build up in your blood vessels, upping your chances of heart disease and strokes. By cutting back, you're giving your heart a break and keeping those blood vessels clear and healthy. It's not just your physical health that gets a boost. Reducing sugar can help stabilize your mood. So. You're less likely to feel these emotional highs and lows that sugar causes. And guess what? Your sleep could improve too. Sugar messes with your body's natural sleep rhythms. So cutting it out can lead to a better, restful sleep. Oh, and if you're prone to breakouts, considering sugar causes inflammation, which can lead to acne. Reducing sugar might just help clear up your skin, giving you a clearer, healthier glow. So, ready to give it a try? Your body and your future self will thank you! Trivia time! Did you know that sugar is a general term for a category of carbohydrate compounds? 
But those granules or cubes of common table sugar are specifically sucrose. To know more, check out our previous video on the topic. Sketching time! Today's sketch of the day goes to Ayush Sa. Hope you learned something new today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Why are you putting honey in the sugar, kitty? I'm thinking it's healthy. Never mind. <laughs>